brother Khalid, look, I see, you know, you got the tattoos. I can see you came from the roots. I understand that you did uh, 10 years general prison. So Allah, he polished the diamond. You know, he polished it. Yes. Okay. So now, being a Muslim, I want you to give some advice to the to the homeboys all over. And I want you to look straight into that camera like you're talking to them. You think gangsters are in paradise? No. Drug dealers are in paradise? No. They are in jail. Mm. No place in China. This life is only a test. Alhamdulillah, Very nice to be here with Brother Khalid from Austria. I just want to first welcome you to Islam. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. How did Islam discover you and how did you discover Islam? Now, this changed my life complete. When I was in the jail, uh, a brother gives me a holy Quran. And you start reading? And I start to reading. And I start to make salah. I'm, I start all. Did you become Muslim inside of the prison or you came Muslim no. outside? Outside. Allahu Akbar. Yeah. When I was in the jail, I don't say the shahada. I, I say I want to say the shahada outside, not in this bad place. How long you spent in jail? In full 10 years, then the last time three and a half years in a high security jail. In 2020, when the lockdown begins, I um, have the feeling I must pray. We got a dog at home, you know? Ooh. And all the time if my wife goes out with the dog, I pray. I got, I, I got the, the feeling I must pray. I have no time, I don't know when it's uh, time for Salah. But I pray. Mashallah. And when I started to pray, complete changed. It makes me so happy if I go into Suchu, I feel like a hero and I feel uh, other power. Were you praying as a Muslim or you were praying as a Christian? As a Christian. Allahu Akbar. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> that's really, that's really, really profound. May Allah bless you, Akhi. May Allah, he, may Allah strengthen you. May Allah, he, may others be inspired by your story. Yeah. It's strange how, how being inside, being restricted and being inside of a prison, how it kind of gives you the opportunity for you to, to listen, to concentrate, and for the heart to become open. Yeah. Mashallah, it's very yeah. profound. I see, you know, you got the tattoos. I can see you came from the roots, like myself. I want you to give some advice to the, to the homeboys all over. And I want you to look straight into that camera like you're talking to them. Mm -hmm. You think gangsters are in paradise? No. Drug dealers are in paradise? No. They are in jail. Mm. No place in China. This life is only a test. You want to be like with me in the jail? It's no problem. It's not just a bad you. You got a family. Be careful. Show the right way, the right path. You don't want to mother your cry, your parents, your brother, your sister, maybe your child too. It's, it's very ugly. And now I'm be humble and I'm more, more, much more happier than ever. I'm so happy now. Alhamdulillah. I can feel the Iman that you have. I can feel it because I've been there. In your career, when you're fighting and when you're getting ready to go inside the ring, when you're facing your opponent, does your faith help you? All the time if I'm fighting and I pray to God and friends from me, they make it funny. They say, what are you doing? You think God can help you? <laughs> and I believe in God. I say, yes, God can help me. Maybe yes, he helps me, maybe not. I don't know. Allah is the best planner. Mm. And while I'm a Christian, when I'm fighting Muslims, I lost. I never win versus a Muslim. Never. Allahu Akbar. Why do you think that is? This is the powerful of faith from a Muslim. He's not scared about his leg, his hands, his head, his face. He's not scared about the death. How you can win? La ilaha illallah. So you can't you, win. Because you have Iman, it gives you the edge as a Muslim because of his Iman. Yeah, for sure, 100%. MashaAllah, 100%. 100%. You're not scared from nothing. How can you lose? Allahu Akbar. It's not possible. Allahu Akbar. MashaAllah. Brother Khalid, listen, I'm so grateful for this meeting. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he bless you. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala keep our hearts together, inshaAllah.